Hi guys, this is Peter from Yaw VR again and this is our new product now. It's a cockpit for the Cessna 172 Skyhawk. We have just created the very first prototype for it. Uh, we have most of the controls working, even the buttons and the knobs for the instruments. But the main solution is that you don't need to create the screens and the instruments because I see it, you don't see it here, but I see it in VR. Uh, and this makes it more affordable, cost efficient and simple to produce it for training. Uh, actually, I can also see my hands, which you can also see on the recording, this blue little stuff. And the virtual cockpit is calibrated or moving in sync with the physical cockpit. So I can touch and use all of the knobs and buttons very well. I can find everything even though I'm wearing VR. And let's see how it works. Let me start the engine of the aircraft. Start. And it's on. Put it back to post. Good. So the flaps are gonna be in middle position now. And I will push the throttle in and try to take off doesn't matter where I take off and actually I can feel that the vibration has changed a lot by moving from the runway to the grass and that is coming from the simulator of course and another vibration is coming from the butt kicker which simulates the vibration of the engine technically the simulator is capable of doing this but it's way, way more realistic with the addition of the butt kicker. I think it's a pretty good experience. The motion is the same as before, so we have the same motion simulator. But now we are allowed to touch and use all of the controls here. And actually I can see the instruments very clearly clearly in front of me and the motion is actually pretty smooth in the air and uh, probably I'm not the judge here but a couple of pilots and flight instructors has just tried this at the Aero Expo in Friedrichshafen and they told the same that it's pretty realistic and that the movement is pretty good so I would trust them on this And I got the gear forces from the motion simulator and it's pretty realistic I would say so it's, it's pretty good to feel it's it's way different than in the air and I did not crash the plane while landing so I'm happy so here I can touch all the instruments and see them in VR. This is what you see in the physical space. It's a blank, black box, but actually I can see everything needed. So here you can adjust the barometer, for example, with this knob, and you can go one way or the other way as well. And then you can also reset it with pushing the button. And I can also turn these knobs turn the buttons uh, I can check the ignition as well the throttle is also moving I can reach out to it pretty easily I can find the flaps easily mixture as well so it's uh, yeah it's pretty intuitive I mean you just sit in see your hands grab the throttle push it in pull it out so this cockpit is now for the Cessna 172 Skyhawk but we plan to create multiple more cockpits and what makes it easy to create more is that you don't have to produce the instruments, the displays and the knobs don't have to be so realistic in the hardware part because you have it in virtual reality. 